Hey guys, what up? It's Goose TV here again today. Today I'm back with another Madden Mobile video on my channel. Now today's video, guys, we are back with yet again another Madden Feast video. Today we are talking about the Feast gift card. We're going to be claiming it and talking about what it might contain, how it might work, what it might be used for, talking about Black Friday, all that stuff in this video today. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on my post notifications so you never miss any of my videos. 70% of you guys aren't subscribed, so please hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Ready. Let's try to get this video to 200 likes. Madden Feast, third day. Having fun with it so far. Obviously, there's been a lot of glitches and stuff at the start. Uh, we will see what's going to happen. I'm excited for Thanksgiving Day and everything like that. There was a bit of a glitch this morning, or I'm not sure what to call it exactly. Um, but there, for some of you guys, might even still have this. I'm not sure what's going on with it, what the status of it is. But there was two extra events underneath. So there's an extra side blitz. There's an extra pie. I'm guessing that was just a glitch, or maybe there, we're going to you know we're actually getting more because a lot of people have complained and it's you know well it's it's agreed that pies are too hard to get right now that is the hardest thing to get um in this promo so we need more ways to get pies who knows what's going to happen with those extra events but those were available so we're talking about the feast gift card today so if we click rewards and we scroll down we have the feast gift card here we're gonna be claiming that here in a second the way you get the feast gift card is by using mac and cheese I made a video the other day on how to unlock the Gobbler event. If you want an in-depth kind of video on how to do that event, which is how you get your mac and cheese, then I would recommend you go check that out if you want to learn a little bit more about that. But basically, by playing the Gobbler event, you're going to get mac and cheese. Sometimes you'll get lucky and get a Feast Elite player, which is really good. But um, if you want the, you know, if you want the stuff, you want if you want the mac and cheese and you want the gift card, um, you got to do the Gobbler event. You can do it up to three times a day. I've already done it once today. I did it three times yesterday. Twice um, on the first day of the promo, I am. I already spent one of the mac and cheese that I got. I haven't gotten lucky yet. Um, the bulk food. It's pretty good. I got some turduckins, got some different sides. It's pretty good uh, for some leftover mac if you're not going to go for the Feast Elite over here or whatever. So um, the Feast gift card is available, available for five mac and cheese here. Um, it says, information, complete this set to acquire a Feast gift card. I wonder if this is used for something on Black Friday. Um, so we are going to click. You can only do it once. Like I said, you can't get a couple of them you can only do one of them so here we go reward pack and we are going to get ourselves right here a feast gift card a madden feast gift card take a screenshot of that for the thumbnail if we We'll flip it on the back like it said I wonder if this is used for something in the Black Friday program so it's used in the Black Friday program obviously that's pretty simple if we zoom in a little bit you will see kind of some of the background of this and you can this is probably going to be the art of Black Friday as you can see kind of in that banner that's my guess it has no kind of art that has to do with feast right now so I would fully expect it to be uh, you know similar to the Black Friday art so this is going to be used in Black Friday now uh, we haven't had something like this in a while where we have kind of a couple promo moving over um, kind of thing but the only thing that it's similar to is kind of like the road signs or similar to like the keys from last promo so if you remember last uh, last month sorry um, each promo had the key that unlocks something for the next promo you know in this case it's the exact same thing an 85 plus program player um, you were able to get with the Martin road sign that was glitched I don't know if it's gonna be something like that because we still have the other key um, of the Watt. So we're gonna have the Watt kind of key thing there. Not the key, but the road sign. We're gonna have the Watt road sign probably for Black Friday, which is gonna give us some sort of player or maybe some tickets. We're not exactly sure yet. So let's kind of talk about how Black Friday works. Because for some of you, you, you know, if you just started playing this game not too long ago or, you know, at the end of the year or whatever, you may not know how Black Friday works. So Black Friday is always one of the coolest promos of the year. It's not gonna be your generic uh, you know masters sets unless they do it. I doubt they will though It's not gonna be your generic stuff There's going to be a lot of fun different things the way it kind of works is you're gonna have tickets or some sort of collectible Usually it's called the blitz promo and you're gonna have like blitz tickets and you use those tickets to trade in for items So rather than just your you know rather than your primary goal trying to get up to masters There's a ton of different ideas and a bunch of different sets you can go for you can go for you know There's gonna be options maybe for some elite players in bulk or some feast players in bulk or maybe there's going to
going to be, you know, a past promo master for a certain amount of tickets. There might be gems. There might be coins. There's a lot of different things, a lot of different items, and they're on full kind of repeat. Um, there's going to be throughout the, the, you know, the length of the promo, it's going to be a dropping on Friday, and I believe Monday's the last day, so uh, I leave Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, four days for that promo. So it's going to be a bit of a shorter one, but it's going to be fun. I'm very, very excited. Like I said, Black Friday is always really good. And there's, like I said, there's always a lot of really fun sets. Last year, we were able to get a ton of Boomer Bust limited time packs. If any of you guys remember that, and we ended up pulling like four or five limited time players, and it was just a lot of fun. I'm hoping for something cool like that this time. But there's also always Masters. There's always Masters. Uh, uh, Night Train Lane is always one of the Masters, like the cornerback, which is kind of weird because we have already two cornerbacks in this promo, but we will see what's going to happen with that. It's not always Night Train land there's always a couple masters usually one per day um, not sure how they're going to structure it this year so let's talk about what the gift card might be used for so first of all our you know some of our predictions might be using it just for another 85 plus player or trading it in you get a, a an amount of tickets it's probably going to be something simple like that i'm sure it won't be anything insane unless they do something crazy to make up for the 85s but uh the gift card like i said uh probably not going to be used for something incredible but it's probably going to be used for maybe getting a, a you know a head start on your ticket you might be able to get 100 tickets or however however many you know you might need or whatever um, using those tickets maybe it gives you an 85 plus but then again we also have the road sign which will be used for that on Friday so who knows exactly what that's going to be used for but I am excited maybe you know it's, it's a gift card so we have to think about it in that way maybe it reduces the price of something maybe you can use it with one item to reduce the price like you know you know you use it in a master set to reduce the cost of the rest of the master I don't know just kind of coming up with different ideas no one knows exactly what it's going to be for but I'm excited to see what it is. A lot of fun speculation. I love these kind of things where we can make these kind of videos speculating about what it might be, how Black Friday is going to work, and we're still a while away. We've still got six days to go. we still got a lot of time um, until this promo. And one other thing I should note about Black Friday that we always get every single year. Um, if you haven't played during the Christmas promo, we have Mystery Box Presents. So, you know, we collect a bunch of presents and different presents, and on Christmas they reveal to be different prizes. On Black Friday, in many years past, they have historically done a fun set of a Black Friday present. So you do the promo, and it's usually worth a lot. It's usually worth like a master, um, and you do that, and you get the Black Friday present, which then reveals either on Christmas or going into the promo sometimes. Last year, what happened was it ended up being a 94 night train lane. So it ended up being like worth a master that unlocked. It was kind of stupid because it had the same art. It was just one overall higher, but it was still really cool to get that. It was worth more at, at that point because the masters during Black Friday were 93, you got the present and it turned into a 94 on Christmas which is a month later so it kind of diminishes the value but it's still fun so look forward to that but the feast gift card like I said used maybe for tickets maybe used for players maybe reducing the cost let me know what you think in the comments below if you have any predictions for what this might be I want to hear what you guys have to say very very interested if you have guys have any other video ideas you want me to upload uh, maybe tomorrow or something I've got some really really fun video ideas planned for the next few days i've got a huge pack opening we got a couple different things i'm super super excited today's post notification shout out because that's a cute 46 but the first person to comment on a video for the next video's post notification shout out but anyways guys that is just about it for the video i hope you guys did enjoy it if you did make sure to like it and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i'm goose tv and i'm out i will see you guys later